You know, it's always a pleasure on the show when we get to talk to the Evansville Blue Devils. You know, they have had such a good run lately in a lot of their sports programs and no different for the basketball programs. We turn our attention to boys basketball and we bring in right now Brennan Banks and Hayden Reese as they are going to chat with us a little bit about how the basketball team is doing. And you guys starting off with some pretty lofty expectations, ranked number four in Division Three in the state. So that's pretty high. So talk about if you could a little bit. Would you think that was too high? Do you think that was uh, right where you guys should be? And what do you guys expect from this upcoming season? Well, I think that was a good ranking for us. I mean, we've won our region two years in a row, hoping to win it a third time. So I thought that was a pretty good ranking for us. Eh, good, yeah. and it's good to get that kind of respect then, you know, and because you guys have won the region, you know, a couple of years in a row, the people are really taking notice, and you guys are ranked pretty high then. So, Brennan, if you could, uh, you're, you're the captain of the team. Tell us some of the strengths that you guys have as a team, and then some of the things that you think you need to improve on. Well, I think our strengths come with, like, all the maturity and all the returning starters that we have, and I think a lot of it's a, we're a really close team. We all like to work out all the time. We get in to the gym as much as possible and our coach really helps us with that. So I think that kind of helps us with how like we can shoot the ball, we can move the ball, we can run a half court offense. I think really what we need to work on right now is our rebounding and defense because we lost Rudy from last year who did, made up a lot of our rebounds and he was a really big shot alter in the paint. So. Yeah, absolutely. A big presence for you guys. Now, Hayden, you're coming off a knee injury, so it's good to have you back, and you were able to make a difference as you guys were able to knock off Beloit Turner. Talk about uh, your play a little bit, and basically, um, if you were going to do some self-scouting, what do you think you bring to the table as a player? Um, well, I would say one of the things we were missing when I was sitting out was like kind of another outside shooter with Brennan, so like teams that took away Brennan. We have a lot of guys that are athletic and can get to the hoop, but not a lot of outside shooting. So, I mean, that's where playing against Blight Turner helped a lot because they can't, like, run, nobody can, you can't run a box in one because we have another shooter on the court now. So that helps. Yeah, and always good to, to stretch those teams out. So now, Brennan, you know, talking to you then a little bit, you know, McFarland knocked you guys off early. What do you guys think that you guys need to do as a team to get back on top of the conference and win a conference championship? Um, I think, well, I think it's more of a learning experience that one game. I mean, I'd rather lose that game earlier in the season than later. I think having Hayden back is going to help us a lot in, like, the long run here. So I'm not really worried about that one loss. I think we just took it as a learning experience and fueled our fire to actually keep this run going that we're going to start here and we're going to win conference this year. I think that. Nice. Like to hear that and excellent yeah. that you actually learned something from that early loss and hopefully you guys can go far as always. So Brennan Hayden, thanks for coming on in and good luck the rest of the way. Thank, Thank you. Thank you.